Hello everybody, I'm Tadashi Mori and this video here I'll teach you how to make the Kusudama Versalis by Christina Burgzig. This origam here is not hard to make each piece but it's really hard to assemble the models so it's really challenging, it's a really nice origam and the result gets really cool. So that's it, let's start! <laughs> So to make this origami you're going to use 60 square sheets of paper Each one you're going to fold like this First of all you have to find here the middle of this side here So you just have to fold the paper in half But you're going to squash the paper only about this much here So just about this much Okay. Now you have to fold, to make a fold like this. So, let me explain in this fold. You have to fold here a line up to this vertex here. And making this vertex here go up to this line. So, again, let me show you just like this okay turn the model over now fold making this line go up to this line and unfold everything now you're going to make a fold along the diagonal but only up to this line here so it would be something like this fold here the diagonal okay. and squash only up to this line here only up to this line right now you're going to make a valley fold along this line this line and this line here at the same time so it's just like this you have to make this fold first okay right so when you make this fold and this fold this one here is going to be easy to make okay now you're going to squash here just pull this flap to this side and squash the paper turn the model over now you're just going to fold here like this and fold this flap to the right like this now you just have to twist here the paper this flat like this it's really well okay this one here also and this one here so I have to twist doing this up to about this point here okay and you're going to make a small curve here in this flap the model is going to look like this one here okay each piece is going to look like this okay so 
Now let's see how to assemble the model and this is the really difficult part of this model. So you're going to first of all join five pieces like this. You have to unfold this twist here, the bigger one, just a little bit. Okay. And you're going to put one twist inside the other like this okay and it's going to look like this right now you have to join this one with this one like this right now you're going to put one more piece here and complete okay close with five pieces okay, so that's it just join here inside like this and join here Now the last one, you do just the same thing, but after you do this, you have to join this twist here with this one, this one with this one, and this one with this one here, and we'll, we'll close one flower. And this Ksudama is going to have 12 flowers total. Okay. So, this is one flower. Now, so keep doing flowers. You, you should have 12 flowers like this one. And you're going to assemble like this. You have to assemble this flower with this one. So two flowers are going to assemble just in one point. Now you have to put here a third flower, closing with the first and the second flower, like this. And this. So as you can see, I made here a triangle. Okay, I did twist three points making a triangle and just keep doing this put here another flower making another triangle another one here and in the end you have this flower and five flowers around this one so you should have something like this by now and as you could notice it's getting harder to make new flowers because it's lacking space so you have to twist here strongly so the flowers get closer to each other so do this okay really strongly so if you still didn't figure out how to continue here I'll show you just a little bit more so it's something like this. You have to, you have two flowers here, right? You have to make a new flower here, exactly here, in the middle of these two flowers. 
so you can make like this make the flower first and then you assemble here like this or you can just keep assembling piece by piece here in the main kusudama I think this way here is a little bit easier but well it's up to you okay so just like this now the next flower you have these three points here you have just assemble three points from the next flower here okay so that's it keep doing this until you have these five flowers Okay, so we are almost finishing here. After you assemble here this last set of five flowers, it's going to look like this. And as you can see, you're going to join here the last flower in the middle. But it's really hard to do this. So, well, before you do this, you're going to do the same thing again and twist here everything really strongly. Or again, you can just assemble piece by piece instead of assembling the whole flower at once. I don't know which one is easier. So, that's it. The origami is going to look like this. I just have here to adjust the petals. Okay, and make some curves here to make every flower look nice. Like, okay, as you can see, this one here is not nice. Just have to add some curve and make it get symmetrical if possible. Okay, like this. So that's it. These are going to look really nice. <laughs> so, thanks for watching this video. See you. Bye bye.